Hello everybody, and welcome back to The Bright Side. I'm your host, Ty, I'm back here today with more Persona 5 Royal. Last time we left off, we finally got to, we finally found Kaneshiro, and in turn kind of got into some trouble. So, uh, we're currently at Kaneshiro, uh, don't look at that. <laughs> we're currently at Kaneshiro's palace, and um, in the process of pretty much about to go in with Makoto, who is here with us because she's now pretty much his source of revenue. Okay, I'll be honest. In my spare time, I've been playing very hard on my own file. So, yeah, that's why I've been trying very hard not to show it. Anyway, <laughs> so here we are, kind of sure the palace, about to go straight through the front door and just be like, what up? Shall we go? What business do you have here? I had a feeling this would happen. Come at us. No, no, wait! She's one of Kaneshiro's customers. I'd like to speak with the bank president. Excuse me, but do you have an appointment? I need to talk to him. Now let me through. Let pass. That voice. It's Kaneshiro. Yo, banks have presidents? Yes, but not the political sorts. In theory. Please wait. Reception is to the right, towards the back. I strongly advise that you do not attempt to go elsewhere. I'll go wherever the heck I want, within reason. Reception is just past this door. I'm not gonna go past you because I don't trust it. Reception is just to the right. Don't go anywhere else. But like, what if I wanna go down that way? This place is gigantic. I think such a large blanket just floating in the sky. I guess anything goes in a palace. This is the reception office. Very on his side. A pyramid of money? How many beef balls could I eat with this? Unauthorized injury, property damage, and other disturbances. That comes to three million yen in total. You're here regarding that, correct, Miss Beautiful President? It must be quite tough gathering so much money. I'd be willing to give you a loan, you know. You gonna call it off then? No, a loan. The interest rate is 10% a day. 10% interest a day? Um, uh, that means uh, one day is... It's 300,000 yen. There's no need to be alarmed. I have a more manageable option for people like you. That was your plan from the beginning, wasn't it? Quite the impressive insight, Nijima-san. Or should I say, the younger sister of the beautiful prosecutor, Sai Nijima. How do you know that? Please don't underestimate our intelligence network. My, what wonderful goods have come falling into my lap. Don't be ridiculous! Young women are such great assets. They lack strength, be it social, physical, or mental. It's as if they only exist to be devoured by the strong. That just might be the rule since the dawn of history. You truly are despicable. You better be ready, Kaneshiro! We're gonna snatch your treasure from you! Don't make me laugh, you petty thieves. My citadel has the highest security installed in it. Anyone will do anything for money. I'll rob you of your lives as easily as I breathe air. <laughs> Okay. 
It's Mr. Kaneshiro's orders. Eliminate them at once. It's you time. can try. You're mine. I guarantee you'll fail. Persona! Persona! Take this! I am thou. Die! Told so. Oh, what crap. Okay. Persona. Let me just... Uh, I need a higher magic stat... With multi-target skills. I think it's gonna have to be... Suzaku, because Phoenix doesn't have any multi-target? That is disappointing. Suzaku! Ravage them! Oh, that sucks. Guards turn into monsters. And what were those supernatural powers? Could those have been the personas you mentioned? Does now really look like the time to be asking that? We need to retreat. Makoto, make sure you don't get separated from us. Hurry, Joker. The exit's just over there. Run. Okay, never mind. There's no end to them. Guys! You seem to be in quite a pickle. How dare you sneak around, Kaneshiro! Those would be my words. However, I do thank you for providing me with such wonderful goods. It's time you disappear. <gasps> Managing a bank is tough as it is. So, it's my policy to kill clients who are more trouble than they're worth. Having one impertinent breath disappear is enough to set an example in that other world. Please, stop! Oh, I wouldn't damage an asset like you. They're dead men walking, but you'll be just fine. Your sister is quite a beauty, though. I'll make sure to make her my personal slave. Once I get bored, I'll just sell her off. Oh, poor sis. She could have been successful. If only her younger sister wasn't so dumb. My sister has nothing to do with this! Then you better start taking customers tomorrow. All you gotta do is endure it, and do as you're told. Endure it. Do as I'm told. You'll learn three million yen in no time. Although your life and everything along with it will be a complete wreck by then. <laughs> I've been listening to you go on and on. Shut your damn mouth, you money-grubbing asshole! Guess right, girl, you tell him. Man, he creeps. Have you decided to tread the path of strife? Yes. Come to me! Very well. Let us proceed with our contract at once. <laughs> I am thou. Thou art I. You have finally found your own justice. Please, never lose sight of it again. This memorable day marks your graduation from your false self. Wow. 
Straight goosebumps. <laughs> now that Makoto is not a jerk anymore. A persona? No, dude. That's a bike. I can feel it. Myself. Me. Just because I normally behave myself. I am done playing nice. Let's go, Johanna! Full throttle! The enemy's agitated. Take them down and make an opening. I'll use my persona! Johanna! Oh, thank you. Oh, wait, no, that's too bad. Ooh. Yep, glad I healed him. It, right? So, you're totally the fist of the Phantom Star now, huh? Do you want to get smacked? I'm going on ahead, so follow me. Damn. Okay, we have a path. Stand against me no matter what. Very well. I'll wait for you all. There's no escape in reality. Nor will you break through the security system here. It doesn't matter what you do. You can kiss your bright futures goodbye. No Aikido. That was some hardcore ass whooping. I am so not pissing her off. Feel like she'll rip off my arm. She does exude that aura. Oh, stop it. This is the most exhausted I have ever gotten these past few years. But it felt pretty great. 
I never thought I'd become part of the Phantom Thieves I was after. Sis might faint if she found out. You mentioned her earlier. She's a prosecutor for the district, and she's investigating the Phantom Thieves. Wait, ain't that bad? No need to worry. A normal investigation would never lead them to a world like that. Then again, it must have been fate for this to happen. What do you mean? I can't be like my sister. I had a feeling that there'd come a time when we wouldn't see eye to eye anymore. I'm thankful to have a sister who works so hard, but... There are times I feel sorry for her, too. And after hearing my persona's voice, I clearly understand how I feel now. It appears you're not as reserved as you make yourself seem. I was just doing whatever the adults told me to. Won't she be perfect as our advisor? She's fearless and has a sharp mind. Sounds good to me. We've needed someone like that for a while now. I'd be honored if I can help out. We had way too much testosterone anyway, so I feel much better. It's from Kaneshiro. He's reminding us of our debt. So the Kaneshiro over here doesn't know what happened inside the palace. That's right. But his palace will be affected if the real Kaneshiro's cognition changes. We can't be lax. Seems it'd be best to avoid unnecessary contact with him until then. Three weeks left, huh? There's that security system, too. But if we pull this off, it'll definitely be great! We'll crush him like a fly. I'll make him regret making me angry. Anyways, let's begin our operation tomorrow. First, we need to secure a route to the treasure, like always. You guys are finally starting to get used to this. I'll be waiting for the call to meet up. All right, cool. We're not done yet. Dang, motorcycles are cool. I wish my persona was like that. Yours is on a ship, though. Dude, you kidding? Motorcycles are way cooler than dumb boats. It'll be just like the song. I'm a phantom on a steel horse I ride. Don't say such things. And for the record, I am most certainly not wanted. Oh, honestly, I'm mostly just surprised you know how to ride a motorcycle at all, Nijima Senpai. Do you got a license? A regular one, yes. Nice. I can't wait to get my hands on one, too. That aside, mind if I change the topic for a moment? What's the matter? I'm sorry, everyone. I know I'm not in any, any position to be saying that. I truly do. However, I must apologize. It was my actions that dragged all of you into this mess. On top of that, I misunderstood your true intentions in this. If only I could have realized what was happening to Suzui-san too. Oops. Come on, we don't need to talk about that now. It seems there are still lingering issues on everyone's minds. Now's not the time to be talking about that shit though. Don't we gotta be doing something about Kanashiro? He's right. Very well, I understand. Anyway, I will still do my best to make sure I don't slow you all down. Well, we were at odds with each other until just a while ago. But Ryuji's totally right. We need to work together to overcome this. Nice! Makoto seems like she'll make a reliable advisor. But now we're going up against a real criminal. Stay on your toes, okay? Hey! Ooh, I got another package. Cool. So, time for that hot transition. When we come, uh, gonna go ahead and skip to tomorrow so we can go ahead and start our infiltration mission. BRB! A motorcycle shaped persona, huh? Yes, I goofed. I forgot about some extra story. You know, I can turn into a car, too, so it's like, I feel a sense of familiarity? I don't know. Motorcycles are cooler. You just don't get it. Don't underestimate the power of four-wheel drive. Well, motorcycles are nice, too, but it can't carry large numbers of people. I really am special after all. Huh? Carrie? No. 
take somewhere? Something just crossed my mind. And it's no use. I can't remember at all. <sighs> eh, there's nothing I can do about it if I can't remember. I need to concentrate on Kaneshiro for now. Unlike you guys, Makoto's clever, so we can expect great things from her. But man, you really do have something special. Looks like I better step up my game too. I feel like my bottom with Morgana is growing deeper. All right. Kitty talk. <laughs> After we deal with Kaneshiro, I should consult her about mementos, too. I'm sure Makoto's brain can... Hello? Ugh. We got Yusuke, and now Makoto. This guy has quite the luck. Could there be some reason for it? Nah, that can't be. I'm sorry for asking you here like this. Oh no, it isn't a problem. I actually find it refreshing to be asked to the student council room. Although it's somewhat nerve-wracking as well. I think I'm a bit nervous myself. Anyway... Um... I wanted to apologize. I'm... really sorry for everything. What do you mean? You know, how I blamed you for Kamoshida's sexual harassment? Well, I wanted to apologize for that. I've honestly been meaning to this whole time. To kamaki -san. I realized later that Shiho was calling out for me. And I wasn't there to help her. I didn't want to admit my own guilt. So I took it out on you, Nijima-senpai. I'm very sorry. Hey... There is no need for that. In fact, I think the two of us are pretty similar. Huh? I was unable to save anyone. Not Suzui-san, and not any of Kaneshiro's victims. I kept telling myself I wasn't at fault because I was simply following orders. But that was all a lie. I felt like I would be admitting my own worthlessness had I not shifted the blame off of myself. Fear of that worthlessness was probably why I acted so harshly toward you and your friends. I'm deeply sorry as well. I see. In that case, wanna call it even? Even? <laughs> You're right. How about we leave this conversation in the past? Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, but one more thing. You're not worthless, Nijima-senpai. You were a bit reckless, but you're the reason we found a way into Kaneshiro's palace. And you even obtained the power to change people's hearts. You did that all yourself, Nijima-senpai. <laughs> that way of thinking is very much like you, Takamaki-san. When you confronted me about Suzui-san, I realized how dishonest and small I was. You're always very direct. That's what helped me finally realize the error of my ways. It turns out I'm a little slow on the uptake at times. Hey, can I call you on? Um, yeah! I... I'm going to do the same. M M Makoto. Ah, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> How about we get something to eat before we go home for the night? Oh, I know a place. There's a crepe shop at Central Street that totally stuffs their crepes. Do you want to split one? Mmm, let's each get a whole one, and then we can go half and half on those. Oh, yes, let's. After school today, right? Girlfriends are great. I realize this is a mite late, but how shall I refer to you, Nijima-san? I believe some courtesy should be shown to those who are our senior. Oh yeah, should we call you Nijima-san or like Nijima-senpai? No need to be formal, just treat me the same as you would anyone else. 
Okay. Would that not be rude? I already call her, just call her by her name. For real? Did something happen? That's a secret between us girls. Dang it, that sounds like fun. All of you may call me by my first name. No need to hesitate. Very well, I shall do just that. Hey, are you listening? Uh oh. I'm gonna get beamed. I'm totally gonna get beamed. Yep. Pay attention. My ninja dodging skills are kinda <sighs> kinda rusty. Our next target is a criminal, one that even the police can't handle. We'll take care of him ourselves and leave the world speechless. The plan of change time Shiro's heart has begun. Try to steal your target's heart by the deadline. Cool! And with that I'm gonna make a quick transition so I can go and grab some stuff I need to get before we head into the palace. BRB! with a super cool idea. Lady On will surely swoon for me if I... Sorry for the wait. So, what's up, Morgana? Apparently, you're supposed to be swooning. From what? Well... It's something I've been giving a lot of thought lately. Now that we've all gained some experience in battle, I think it'd be good for us to work on our finishers. Our finishers? Yeah. I guess if we're going to keep fighting, we ought to do it with style. Right? Right? So I came up with just the idea. It's maybe my best one yet. And we can definitely pull it off if you play a part in it, Lady On. Me? Well, okay. What do you need me to do? Now that's our Lady On. Quick on the uptake. What I had in mind was... And that should do the trick. Really? So is that a no? Well, it's not that I don't want to. It's more like, isn't your idea sorta impossible? Even in the metaverse? Huh? What was that? The star Jose gave to us started glimmering. <laughs> Could it have reacted to something? What's up? I never imagined that I would end up helping the Phantom Thieves. Things would get interesting if my sister ever found out. There's no time to be getting sentimental here. Yes, I understand. I do have one request about all of this, though. Can you teach me how to be a Phantom Thief? Like, about the Metaverse, for example? Simply put, that world is formed of a person's cognition. There, you can change people's hearts. Yeah, I've gathered that much just from going there once. But the method of transportation still eludes me. I mean, it's a smartphone navigation app. You only need a name, a location, and a distortion. After the first entry, the palace is bookmarked. You really just make it sound like an ordinary app. Aren't there any dangers associated with it? Don't worry about that. We've already been a bunch of times and it... That's not what I mean. It's a navigation app, right? Couldn't someone easily access our history on the server? Wait, why are you looking at me like that? Has nobody thought of this before? I... Now she's catching me off guard, too. And we don't know where it came from, right? It showed up on my phone without any input from me. Do you know anything about it? A long-nosed, weird man. What? I want to tell the truth, but it's tough to explain that Igor has been sending out the app. I don't fully understand, but I don't think we have to worry about people accessing our data. From what I can tell, this app is incredibly special. It wasn't made by any ordinary means. True. An app that allows you to enter another world isn't exactly commonplace. Well... 
Sis doesn't know who the Phantom Thieves are, so I suppose our information is safe for now. We're still learning things ourselves. I hope your sharp wit can help us with that. Thank you. I'll do my best. More importantly, we need to stop him from releasing those photos. If the public gets a hold of them... I could only imagine what would happen then. Come on, just gotta take care of him before the time limit. We'll bounce back from this. Plus, people will really start admiring us if we can manage to take this bastard down. Yeah, this is the perfect opportunity. We have to succeed no matter what. All right. Kanashiro's henchman said the deadline is July 9th. Which means we're going in. Let us go. And of course, because this is Persona, we're gonna be finishing this palace in one day. So what am I gonna be called? You all were using code names, weren't you? You're quite perceptive. This time's a hard one. Maybe something like, uh, shoulder pads? No, stop. Why in the world did you focus on that? I refuse to be called that. What about Ryder? Sounds too much like a smuggler. Next. Fixer? I'm not a mastermind, though. Next. Won't you give me something better to work with? She reminds me of an empress. You got anything, Joker? I mean, I could totally say which. It'd be funny. You know, I've actually never said anything besides Queen. I'm kind of curious. What happens? That works, in a way. I'd like it to sound a little more refined than that. She's totally a queen, isn't she? That's it! Queen? <laughs> it has a nice ring to it. Okay, I figured I they'd get to the end it. eventually, but I just Let's wanted to know that. what she would now say. Now then, could you explain to me the strategy for this mission? Uh, strategy? You don't have one? Wait, the Phantom Thieves were acting without any plans? Uh, we pretty much look around the area. I provide navigation when needed. And then, uh... If we'd run into shadows, we'd beat the shit out of them. Very well, then. I feel like I'll be useful for sure. Seems my role is to be the brain of this team. I'll analyze Mona's information and give out orders. Any objections? No, none queen! I bet Skull's definitely the type that'll be under a girl's thumb. Mona, will you begin navigating us? Yes, Queen! <sighs> Him too, it seems. <laughs> Alright, cool. Indeed. It seems we were able to use the same myth that his last time to get here. Apparently we are acknowledged as customers who can be extorted. And that's fine. We can take advantage of his negligence. <sighs> Though I will say, it's a little scary every time. Alright, um... I don't need Ryuji and Makoto, even though Makoto is good with magic too. I'd rather have Yusuke. Sorry, Ryuji. Cool. What the heck is this? It seems as though they didn't want to leave that gaping hole, hmm. but we can't get in now. Sorry, I. I think I might have taken it a little too far. Nah, you're good. Nice. That's right. We would have been in serious danger had it not been for Queen's actions. Thanks. Joker. The details are no longer important. Let us search for a new infiltration point, Joker. I don't need to go into the velvet room, so I think I'm good. Mm hmm. I feel a draft coming from underneath the statue. Doesn't this seem strange to you, Joker? That placard. Why don't we check it out? Funk. Whoa! Ooh, a hidden passage. Let's head inside. After we're adequately prepared, uh, adequately prepared, of course. So now, I would say, given this interior design, we are inside the bank. Seems our plan went well. I don't remember seeing this place last time. Just where exactly are we? There has to be a map somewhere. 
For now, let's try to explore and search for the treasure. Okay, real quick though. <laughs> One second. And I'm back. So in my own playthrough, I have specifically Ana and Makoto in the Catherine outfits because man, they look good at them. Like seriously, those outfits look really good on them. Previously, I decided to go with the P4 outfit and the Protag 3, uh, P3, so everyone looks different. All right, let's go. Focus. Hold on a second. What is that? A shadow in the shape of a dog. It seems this place has its own watchdogs. Hmm. I don't like the looks of this. You mean because you're a cat? Hell no! I mean it might be able to sniff out intruders or hunt us down super fast. But if it does end up making trouble for us, that could actually work out in our favor. We'll have a chance to finally show off our surprise finisher! Sorry to butt in. We've been spotted. I only didn't change the Yuji's outfit because he's not here. Oh, you jerk. <laughs> not bad. But love always burns the brightest when facing down an opponent like this. Panther, I think the moment's finally arrived. It's showtime! Huh? You wanna do that right now? Jeez. Fine. Here we go. Ready to go! Showtime, an attack where two team members were together, has been unlocked. Showtime activates at the start of a party member's turn. It is a powerful attack that can only be used at this time, and will not consume HP or SP. Mm. You can use Showtime by pressing the touchpad when the Showtime icon appears. Lego. I love the Showtime events, they're honestly great. This is how I really feel! Seriously, who wouldn't love that? I don't skip them no matter how many times I've seen them because they're just that great. This is amazing! Dude, what was that just now? When do you guys figure out how to do something like that? <laughs> it's simply the fruit of our secret passionate training. Hmm, yeah, I guess we did put some effort into it. Still, I'm surprised it went so well. Do you think Oh, you know what it could have been? Maybe it was because of that thing of the thing Jose gave us? That star-shaped thing? I think it even gave off some kind of twinkle back then. Back then? Oh, you mean when I told you about the team-up idea? Um... So, in other words, the star, I guess we'll call it, reacted to Mona's wish to fight alongside Panther? Wish-granting stars. If that's truly the case, we're just encountering one strange phenomenon after another. I don't really get it, but what I know is, if Mona and Panther can pull that off, can't we do it too? Wouldn't that be sick? What about this? Hey Fox, you wanna try coming up with one of those badass moves of our own? We could call it like Heart Run or something. <sighs> Come on, quit giving me that look. Hmm. There's a lot we this don't understand is... about how this works, as usual. But what I do get is, if we use these stars right. We'll be more than ready. We'll be more ready than ever for our battles. Showtime is most likely to occur when you baton pass to Akira or to another member at a pinch. Uh, uh, or to another member at a pinch. It can also happen when an enemy is near defeat. At first, Showtime will only activate for An and Morgana. However, you will obtain more combinations as the story progresses. Showtime may come available even if the other party member is in reserve. You can view the various combinations of their stats in the triangle menu. Or in the menu. You know what I mean. Anyway. Now that that's been solved. Show me your true form! I'm gonna make my way through here just killing the shadows <laughs> along the way. So I'll be back when I see something important. That's not important. BRB! 
I had to come back because there's one cool thing I want to note that's different about this game. So before, this room down here that's right outside of, like, or right inside of this area, you couldn't go through this door. Now you can go through this door and then climb up here, and it gives you a shortcut to get up here. Boom! Now I'm on the next floor. Okay, I'll be back again. Now that I've taken care of all the enemies in this area, I want to go ahead and highlight something that I missed in my own playthrough and was stuck for like a couple of minutes because I'm just like, what am I supposed to do? So this door is locked, but I need to get in here because this is where the security room is. So I was running around for a while just like, how am I supposed to get in there? And didn't even notice I have something. this. I don't know how my blind butt did not see it, but I didn't. <sighs> that shadow's in our way. What should we do, Joker? Kill him. Show me your true form. In his life. Oh, well, that's super pathetically easy. I already recruited all of them. They might not all die, but you know what? That's fine. Yep. I'm kind of weak. Beautiful. We somehow managed. This appears to be some kind of monitoring room. I hope we can find clues in here. Hey! I think I found something. Ain't this some kind of key card? Oh? And over here is a map. As expected, there seems to be quite a large basement floor. I bet that's where the treasure is. Hmm. However, only a portion of it is depicted here. Unless we can obtain another map, we won't know for certain. A cursory glance shows this building alone has one underground level. It would probably make sense to head there first. Shall we go on that elevator we found earlier then? That should be our last resort. First, let's see if there's any way to use this key card. Alright, time for more exploration. BRB! Okay. I had to make sure I went and grabbed anything I missed, but so that key card let us open this door. And so we're on top of the elevator, which means we're going down. Yes. Very well. We simply need to wait for it to move now. Ten years later. Oh man, we're finally going. Security, listen up! Is that kind of sheer? It looks like some rats have infested this place. Under no circumstances let them further down. Strengthen security as much as you can. Understood? It looks like... It seems painfully obvious where the treasure is now. But the map from earlier doesn't show that much. I wonder if there's another one somewhere. In any case, heading down should be the best move. Let's keep our eyes out for a map while we explore. Alright, gonna go ahead and continue exploring and I'll be back. Don't judge me, but I really just want to show this off because this is hilarious. So we find that we passed by some cameras, security cameras pretty much. And so we went down the hallway. Yeah, they're just like, you can't, can't use your observational skills, make sure that we don't get in their range. And then we come up to this thing at the end of the hall. Is that a device of some kind? Let's go check it out. Sure. Oh yeah, so those are the cameras. And they're all over there. Mm. Seems to be a power supply box for something. The word camera is written on it. 
Oh, it's supposed to be for the surveillance cameras. Let's destroy it. Kick. I love that kick. Nice it's going. so ridiculous. So yeah, we're going to be kicking things for a while. I'll be back again. Okay, so after a lot of smashing and a lot of thrashing, <laughs> we finally get to this next area. It's an exceedingly spacious room. Mm. According to the map, we should be able to head down from here. Hey, did you hear? It's not like those intruders are wreaking havoc in here. Hey. Everyone, quiet down. I hear someone talking. So this floor is, and Mr. Kaneshiro ordered us to... Yeah, but still, I mean, with these two keys to happen... Hmm? Keys? What are those shadows talking about? I wasn't able to pick up everything they said. If only we could get closer. And then they move away and turn on cameras. What did you say? More surveillance cameras. There are shadows in there. It's probably too dangerous to get any closer right now. Hey! I'm curious about the conversation they were having, but there's nothing we can do about it at the moment. For now, let's just focus on finding a way down. Which means I can go over here. And down here. Whoa. Is this some kind of a vault? According to the map, there's a great deal more beyond here. Then this is not a vault, but a partition of sorts. The terminals there must be how you open it. But... Both of them have keyholes, meaning we'll need two keys to get beyond this area. For real? Ugh, such a pain in the butt how secure this place is. Eh, it's gotta be important though. It would seem that's correct. This may lead further down, just as Kaneshiro had mentioned. Hey, perhaps the key that those shadows are talking about goes here. Let's go. That sounds likely to me. All right, let's go back to that room. Hold up. Don't forget about the security cameras. <sighs> Good point. They're a pain, but we should deactivate the security cameras first. Which is easier said than done, because that means I gotta go everywhere. Everywhere. All right. Transition. Alright, it took a while, but I finally made it. Killed everything, broke all the cameras, uh, even went back and summoned some new personas. So, we're finally at the security room. About those intruders. Oh, are you really that concerned? Don't be. We have the keys they need, so things should be okay as long as we protect them. What? Wait, you think they're talking about those two keys? Just as expected, those are highly likely to be what opens the partition. What are we gonna do then? Beat them up and take the keys? Listen up! Really, Skull? Just look at them. They're not your average shadows. Anyone in charge of such important keys must be extremely strong. And there's two of them. Dealing with both of them would be tough. Plus, they could go and sound the alarm. Mm. That's a good question. Then why don't we split them up and beat them individually? And how will we do that? Remember that monitoring room upstairs? The room we got the map in? There was some communication equipment there as well. We can use that to lure one away. That's a good idea. Yeah. I agree. Sounds a lot safer than fighting them both at the same time. Okay, let's leave this part to our, to our resident intellectual. Thank you very much. Thanks. So first we need to head to the monitoring room. Think we should head over there now? Yes, because I have nothing else I need to do here. Um, hold up, before that though, I forgot. I actually do need to do one thing. Um, who has it, who has it? Yusuke. Because I am running low on SP. Well, a lower than I like. Give it a try. Are we ready? Go for it. Um. Okay, stay quiet during this. Come in, security room. This is the monitoring room. We've been ambushed by intruders. Requesting backup immediately. One person will be perfect. Roger that. We'll send someone your way at once. All right. And here we go. All we need to do now is wait for the enemy. Bang. 
The way they run is hilarious. Hmm? There's no one here? Not exactly. You're... This was a trap? You bastards. Face my wrath. You know, I actually don't remember what your weakness is. That's concerning. Um, it's time. Well, as for personas that I got, I went and got um, Sudama, Linon, Nigimikama, Matador, and I thought I got Shiki. Oh wait, no, I use Shiki Oji. So those are who I have. I think. I think you're. I hope I'm right. I'm not. Nope, that was wrong. You're probably psychic, aren't you? Oh well. I'll use my persona. Dabble just dabble. Let's go. Prepare yourself. Persona! Take this! Persona! So, it should be psychic. Nope, you... I don't know your weakness. All right, queen. Beautiful. Beautifully dodged. Cool. Oh. Ooh, he had a key. I guess that went pretty, pro pre uh, pretty well, huh? All right. I mean, there should only be one shadow in the security room. We'll snatch the other key from it while we can. Hey. And let's go. Um, I don't think I need to heal or anything, so let's just go. Why isn't he coming back? Why isn't he coming back? Did something have happened? Now then. We'll be heading right into battle when we charge in there. Ready? Yes. Yes. Who are you? We're here for the other key. What? in that column earlier. How dare you! You killed my friend! I know your weakness. I've already fought you. It's time. Which means you're going to die. Oh, what? You said do it again? Sure thing. Do it again. Oh, so close. Here he comes. Mm, okay. Oh, wait. Oh, all right. Oh, we're good. Make it Cool. Perfect. We've now obtained both keys. Oh, just one moment. Doesn't this map have a little more information than our own? Nice. Oh, right you are. Well done, Queen. Maybe you can tell us what the bank is like further down. How's it look? You see where the treasure is? Mm. Well, the most suspicious area would be the deepest part. Look here. There's an elevator that leads down. Treasure must be passed there. Indeed. This map seems to indicate that the area beyond the partition is rather large as well. I'm sure security will keep getting more intense from here onward too. We need to be careful. All right, cool. Since we did that, we're gonna go ahead and go down here and unlock that partition. Okay, let's try turning it all at the same time. On three. One, two. This took some time, but we managed to force it open. Great teamwork, everybody. Yes, I agree. The cooperation of our whole team is what helped us through this particular ordeal. Uh, I don't think I missed anything, so let's go. Dude. 
There's money all over the floor. So he took all of this from the weak. He's going to pay for this. And on that note, this is actually where I'm going to go ahead and end this episode. I'm going to, in between episodes, go ahead and do some, um, a little bit more exploring. There shouldn't be any other story just yet because I'm not close Somewhere. enough. But I need to grind as well. So I'm going to go fight some stuff, get some levels, and when I come back, we'll continue exploring through more of this area. Oh wait, actually I should probably get this out of the way. Ah. Wait, Joker, hide. What, more cameras? No. No, these ones seem different from what we've seen before. They turn on and off. It might be a surveillance system that switches between multiple cameras for efficient coverage. What about that this? That just means we gotta pass by when it's not recording, yeah? That should work, but there are guards to watch out for too. We should proceed with caution. So yeah, I'm gonna get through this area. It's somewhere. And then I'm going to, um, also there's a will see, like, over there, outside of here. Um, but yeah, <laughs> when we come back, I'll be a higher level, have more, probably, personas and money, and we'll be a little bit further in this palace. Not too much further, though. Because I'm not gonna go on the elevator or fight anything like near there or fight uh, any bosses or anything. So, like always, I'd like to thank you guys for joining me today. Don't forget to hit that like button, the subscribe button, and the notification bell to be notified of all future content updates, including more Persona 5 Royal and the Final Fantasy VII Remake. If you haven't already gone over to my Twitch channel and hit the follow button there, you're missing out on the Final Fantasy VII streams because they're good and they happen pretty much daily. Like always, I'd like to thank you guys for joining me today and I hope you have a wonderful day.